right, good evening. It's time to begin our uh, preschool three, pre-K four program. And I know they're excited. And I saw the cost, you saw your children's costumes. I think they could probably just stand up here in the exciting program. Uh, but uh, they're ready and they're excited to share with you what they're gonna perform. So let's have a word of prayer and we'll get started. Our Father, <coughs> Heavenly Father, we thank you tonight for these boys and girls. We thank you for the families, the homes they represent. We're thankful for their parents and grandparents and guardians. And Lord, we just pray that you'll help them now to do a good job. Help them not to be nervous or afraid. Give them uh, the ability to do what they've practiced so hard to do. Pray it'll be an enjoyable program this evening for us. And we'll give you the praise and glory in Jesus' name. Amen. Welcome to the Kingdom of Preschool with friends that were new. We welcome each Lord and Lady too. Come into our castle to learn and play. We're waiting for you. It's celebration day. Lords and ladies, let's do our pledges. See no evil, see no evil, see no evil. 
My lords and ladies, it takes much training to prepare to live in a castle. Let's take a look at training behind the scenes. Well done, lords and ladies. Time is moving swiftly. I need to check my calendar. Hmm, lots of important things coming up. Um, let's review the months of the year. January, February, March, and April. Okay, okay, it's May, but what day of the week is it? Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, then we start again. Ta 
Today is Friday. Oh, lords and ladies, today is Friday. It's the day of the Royal Tournament. We better check the weather. Sometimes storms make us afraid. will be coming from all over to attend this grand event. Let's review the letters and sounds of the American language. requires good manners. Always say please and thank you for your snack. Obey right away with a happy heart and a happy face. It's time for the event. Let's go to our places. <laughs> Good day, my king. To begin our royal tournament, let's have our young lord share words from the royal decree.
the truth, it is mighty than the neither a wife. I will be brave because my kingdom has no need of a coward. I'll be honest because my kingdom has no need of thief. I will be one to prove my castle, the greatest kingdom on earth, and I will be justice, honor, and faith. Goose, 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 goose. On with the tournament. First up is our acrobats. Akira Takahashi. Thomas, wow. Riley Matson, and Georgia Uptegrove. Chickens dancing at a wedding. The white hen, CA. <laughs> Next up is the parade of ladies. Madison. And now for 
our final event, our jousting tournament. Let's see what else is in the royal treasure chest.
by tens. What does the Bible say about kings? learned about some great kings this year. Although David was a shepherd boy, he was annoyed to be a king. A mother lied to King Solomon, but God gave him wisdom and saved the baby's life. King Josiah was just a boy, but he restored the temple and worshiped God. rose again. King rose again for, for those who have received him as their savior. We hope this program has been a gentle reminder of the treasures that live under your roof each day. You're raising children, children made in the likeness of God, preparing them for a kingdom. So no matter where you choose to live or go to school or even where you attend church, make time for Jesus because his kingdom lasts forever.
of houses and lands. He holdeth the wealth of the world in his hands. Of rubies and diamonds, of silver and gold, his coffers are full. He has riches as untold. together before we close tonight. I'm a child of the King. I'm a child of the King. With Jesus my Savior, I'm a child of the It would be appropriate to give your boys and girls another round of applause for a good time. I <laughs> also want to thank uh, Mrs. Hook and uh, Miss Bell, her aide, and Preschool 3, Mrs. Hill over there with the frogs. Uh, I just thank you, thank you all for your work. Uh, King Noah, also, uh, he's been a student teacher this year, working on a degree in college, and we're happy to have him back as one of our graduates, so that's been a blessing. Um, before we stand to pray, I just want to remind you of a couple things. Uh, one, if you did not order a DVD, uh, they were, it, the program was recorded, and you can purchase that at the door tonight. Uh, and then 
Uh, it is, the program was live streamed uh, on the school Facebook page and Fayette Bible Church's YouTube page. So if you want to go back and see it there or share that with family members who are distant, uh, you can do that as well. Uh, and then as we close, I would like to put before you the question uh, that was uh, suggested in the song that the boys and girls sang at the end. And that is, are you a child of the King tonight? Uh, it's not something you're born into automatically. Uh, we're born outside of God's kingdom. Uh, and, uh, but you can be adopted uh, through faith in Jesus Christ. You can be saved and made a child of the King. doesn't matter how old you are. Uh, and I trust that you let the words of that song and the verses you heard tonight uh, sink into your heart and, and let the Lord uh, do a work there according to His will. Uh, we're thankful for all of you and uh, you're entrusting our, your children to us. Uh, it's a big responsibility. It's something we don't take lightly. Our teachers, as you can see by tonight's program, do a wonderful job. And I trust that the foundation they're laying for your boys and girls, uh, you allow it to be built on. Uh, continue to strengthen that foundation uh, in the home, uh, in church, and uh, let the Lord uh, raise up a godly generation. We need it. Uh, we need young people who are going to stand up and speak out the truth against the flood of error that is being pushed on us now. So I uh, just want to share those thoughts with you. Let's stand, please, while we're in prayer. Frog, if you're a frog parent, your frogs are over there. If you're a parent of a lord or a, a lady, a lady or a knight, or I think it looks like Robin Hood personally, uh, but I like it. So your children are over there, all right? And there's a photo op place there. If you want to have pictures taken or you're taking anywhere here in the deal, will be fine. Uh, let's pray. Heavenly Father, thank you tonight for your kingdom. Uh, your kingdom will never fall. It will never fail. And I thank you for the things that boys and girls share with us tonight. They're getting a good academic foundation, but more importantly, they're learning about you. And I pray, Lord, that uh, the truths that they're having instilled into their hearts through your word and uh, through their Bible lessons each week, that will, those things will bear fruit. Thank you for these families and for uh, their love of their children that puts, allows them to put their children here in our school. Lord, we just ask for your blessing as we leave tonight. We thank you for your goodness and faithfulness. In Jesus' name, amen.